Never thought I'd say this, but Electronic Arts has done something that no other digital distributor has done in favor of the consumer. Drop me a line in the comments below, but first, my opinion. I'm Tarmac, and this is Feature Creep. This is something I want to see more of. EA announced a policy change for Origin. You now have the possibility of a full refund of digitally purchased video games on the Origin platform. Here's the scoop. You can return your digital game before the first of any of the following three conditions. Within 24 hours of having first launched the game, within 7 days from when you purchased the game, or within 7 days of the release date if you pre-ordered it. So basically, if it comes out and the reviews are terrible but you haven't played the game yet, you have a week to change your mind. Or, if you just couldn't wait and started playing right away, if the game is absolute garbage within the first 24 hours, you can get your money back. It's one hell of an interesting change for a few reasons. First of all, it is worth noting that on this issue, EA is actually in a better consumer-friendly position than Valve. Steam has no refund mechanism except in very drastic situations like the War Z, or the other option of a lawsuit in the UK under the fit-for-purpose laws. And color me surprised, EA has for well over a decade been the big faceless corporation that was a necessary evil in the game industry because they were one of the few groups with enough money to fund big development. Unfortunately, they then went on usually to buy up the developers they previously funded and grind profits out until they ultimately closed the now derelict studio. For EA to take a position in favor of the consumer like this is an excellent move in the right direction. Now, I don't think that you should forget all the wrong that they've done, but this does deserve points, quite frankly. The second issue is one that may well have a much longer reaching impact in the game industry itself. Right now, the refund feature, though, seems only available to EA games rather than an origin-wide situation regardless of developer. Hopefully this changes. Why? Well, obviously because it means more choice, but more importantly because it will begin to hold developers to a higher standard. No longer will you be able to hide review code from the media or hide a bad game behind a release day embargo. People will still have an opportunity to back out of your product if it's trash. Perhaps we'll see less buggy, unfinished games released when publishers start to see significant refund numbers. And further to that, it's much more likely now that Valve will be strong-armed into offering the same policy on Steam. After all, they've been sort of sitting on their laurels lately while Origin has been gaining ground in terms of subscribers, download speeds for many people, and now customer advocacy. Now, I do see some more areas for improvement in the industry, and it would be exciting regardless of who takes up the torch. Three words. Used digital games. Now, I know what you're thinking. He's crazy, right? Not at all. Imagine a system where a portion of a game could be resold on an auction house style platform. Take Black Ops Ghost for example. Person A buys a new copy, plays the single player for a while, does some multiplayer maybe, but then ultimately has had enough. Now imagine that he or she can hop onto an online marketplace and put up their copy of the game for sale, thus removing it from their account with Origin or Steam or whoever else manages the marketplace that takes a cut of the action of course. Keep the money raised by the original owner in an online account that they can access to buy other new or used games. The used game would be sold as a single player client only with no multiplayer or DLC additions for whatever the market will bear, much like any other auction house. If the player loves the game and wants that DLC or multiplayer, they can then pay the difference between what they paid for it used and what it would cost new, including of course any sales going on at the time. You want a way to turn the idea of the online pass into a positive EA? There it is. You can send me a PM and I'll give you my address for the royalty check. So, given that Origin is starting to become more consumer friendly, I thought I'd ask if you or people you know have started to use it. Let me know in the comments below. Also, make sure you hit subscribe so you don't miss any content. That's all I have to say. Tarmac out. <laughs>